Hi everybody. Um, I just figured I'd uh, <coughs> do a video of me doing dishes today since I uh, was um, you know, doing the laundry one. And the only thing I'm going to do with some of the dishes here, I don't leave them in the uh, sink when I wash them. I soak them up and then I put them in the drain board right away because um, if they cover the hole and all the water is backing up into the sink and then you got to rewash the plate because, um, you know, sinks, even though I had just washed it before I uh, started, there's still, I'm sure, a certain amount of germs in the sink. So, like I said, I just figured I, um, when I was doing chores, I <coughs> do uh, some dishes. And I might do another video of me doing some more laundry. The uh, dryer just stopped. Like I said in my other videos, I don't um, do undergarments. Underwear and bras on a video. I will do socks on video, but not um, underwear and bras. So I feel too personal. No, I don't even care if it's men underwear. That's, a, I, in my opinion, too personal. Now normally I don't let the water run, but because I don't want these to sit and block the whole one, um, I'm doing these one by one and then putting it in. Oops. But um, then after I do these couple, I'll rewash it with the bottom part of the sink where the bowls and that plate are going to sit. So at least this way, um, you see I cleaned again. Well, you didn't see me clean the first time, but um, you get to see me clean this time, so you uh, know that this, where the dishes are going to sit, it's clean. What's your least favorite chore? Um, mine is pretty much the dishes, but everything's got to get done. Dishes, laundry, sweeping and mopping the floor. It would be nice if we could just hire a robot to sweep them off the floor, vacuum the rugs, do the dishes and laundry. Making the beds is not too much of a problem, especially if the bed isn't up against the wall, but even bed making sometimes is a pain in the neck. But again, it is what it is. Now, let's see, I'm going to... Just wash this a little bit. Not perfect. We're just good enough to put the uh, dishes down on here uh, no, so that's clean. The only thing I um, like about uh, doing the chores myself uh, you know, washing the dishes, sweeping and mopping the floor. We don't have rugs to vacuum. But on days like this where it's dreary, on again, off again rain, it, um, you know, helps to, to do the, sweep and mop the floors, do the dishes, vacuuming. You will get to move a little bit because you no sense taking a walk and then you get caught in the rain. Your feet get, uh, get soaked and anything not covered by the raincoat get soaked, your legs, your skirt, you know, whatever, pants. You now even with boots on, sometimes you could still get drenched if the uh, rain is blowing. These dogs are so noisy. I'm going to rinse these a little bit and then I'll do the last bowl and the utensils. You know, when our kids usually only help when they want to, or if you throw them a few bucks. I mean, not all kids, just most of them. You know, it's a pain in the neck sometimes. You gotta let them soak up. Dishes is something soak overnight because um, 
Now sometimes when you cook, the food gets stuck on them. So you gotta let them soak overnight. Now I like an empty sink when I go to bed. It was, uh, you know, something my mother always liked. So I always make sure that the sink is empty overnight. You know, sometimes that's not possible, but you know, it is what it is. Especially when you gotta soak things. utensils in this bowl until then this record uh <coughs> oh, excuse me for coughing um no it's been I coughed I didn't cough on it but just so that you guys know you see you redo the inside um not sure how long this video is gonna be so I just gotta rinse the one bowl and a handful of dishes uh, uh the one bowl and a handful of utensils If you have any tips and tricks to help do dishes and what have you, um, you know, if there's an easier way of doing them without a dishwasher, then you know, feel free to uh, let us know. Or if you uh, have something that you soak them in to help get and they can stuck on off, um, up to suggestions on that as well. I mean, whatever makes life easier so you could get more done in a day. So yeah, look guys, the more you could get done in a day, so, uh, the better it is because you could, um, you know, maybe have, if you just start on stuff, say Monday, you might have everything done by Thursday if you could find your easier ways of doing things. And if you could keep your uh, weekends free, so if you could start doing stuff say Monday and have everything done Thursday, then you're free Friday, Saturday, and Sunday to do what you want. Oh, I got one more knife I can see. And it's a pain in the neck too when you gotta soak clothes in a bucket or a shout them or whatever it is you use to uh, soak them or to get stains out. I'm going to have lunch after I do this. Not sure what I'm having yet. I just have some pasta and meatballs. I don't have a little towel out here, so I'm gonna bring the, use this one to wipe the counter down. I always wash my hands before doing the dishes and when I'm done with them. Now, even if we're not sick, there's still um, no germs on everything. Well, the kids go to school and they don't always wash their hands. Um, my niece uh, had one teacher, so she's still in elementary school, had one teacher that every day before lunch um, would make sure they wash their hands. The teacher she's got now, don't make them do that. She, uh, the, the teacher that had them wash their hands, they'd stop off at the bathroom, and she'd let three go in at a time. Then when somebody came out, she would send another one to three kids in. It was at three, two or three sinks, but um, even if there was only two sinks, I can't remember. Uh, you know, you could still send in multiple as long as you know they could get along uh, while doing um, their hands together. Well, I'm going to let you guys go now while I figure lunch. Happy Saturday. Have a blessed weekend and enjoy, uh, hopefully you're going to enjoy your day and your weekend like I am. Have a great day. Bye.